She had, she had, I mean, I took her to the doctor about a, what, a week ago. She had a bronch, real bad case of bronchitis. Okay. Any uh, diabetes, anything like that? Nope. Nope. No. No. High blood pressure? Nope. Uh, we can just, you know, down that, 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 that ramp. I, I'm kind of leery about that ramp right yeah, now. It's slippery. Yeah. Do you want to go by ambulance for sure? Want to go by ambulance, mom? Yeah. yeah. But my wife, my wife's got, I mean, my wife's got the car keys and that's, her, and that's the car out there. So I don't know where to see. Be back after a while. So. Well, we're gonna have to get you down that ramp. Okay. Well, let's, let's get her. Let's get her on wheelchair. All right. The best way. We're gonna have plenty of guys on it. So. Okay. We'll try and get you down the road. Come on, mom. What's your birthday? Uh, six, six twenty-eight thirty. Just um, Methodist, Mom? Yeah. Mom? You want to go to Methodist or we go to Lutheran? Yeah. Methodist. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
for right now. Yeah, for right now. He can come in for right now. Nope. Nope. There we go. Nope. Never mind. How's the roses? Look. Still? No, they're wet. They're all dry. They're dry. They're dry, dry, but they're they're just wet. Okay. (laughs) Off to the dry. Okay, let me go come out with new protocols. We used to take everybody with us, but we were in an accident. You and I went to the and our rider got injured, and now there's many lawsuits. So we're not only liable for the patient at that point, we're liable for everybody else in the car. So they said, unless it's a life or death, like a show dying or something. Oh, Bob, Bob, what's the John, what's the point? Yeah, they don't want us to take an actual idea. I'll have to bring a cow. I'll have to take a cow. Where's the other pedal? We've got to go too far. We're driving. Where's that? Huh? Where's my pedal? Right here, Mom. Is that it? No. I'll have to call her cab. I'll have to call her cab. <laughs> my, my wife, uh, don't, don't like driving in the snow either, so. I don't blame her. <laughs> oh, we're losing the shoe. Oh, no, we just can't see you there. I'll scare the shoe. Just keep her leg up. We'll put it on. We're going to take a cab. We're going to take a cab. Yeah. I'm going to cut out. Well, that's what it's been for right now. Okay, got it. Good to cut out. I know. Mommy lost the door. There you go. I took the airplane. Yeah. We took the airplane. We'll just leave that right here for right now. Yeah. 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 We'll be there. We'll be there as soon as we can get there, Mom. Yeah. Me and John will be there. As soon as I'll we take the time. The symptoms aren't priority, so I'm not, there's no guarantee either that we'll get right yeah. in the room. Yeah. So yeah. Okay. No rush. Uh, right. Well, see, my my wife works for what? Works for Methodist Hospital too. So. Gotcha. So, What's her name? Uh, Crystal Martin. She works on Yonker. She works on Yonker Five. She's a, she's a uh, uh, what do you call it? A uh, hostess. Oh, okay. oh that's it. Yeah, I just told you it's going to you. Yeah. yeah. I'm the maintenance and taking care of her here too. So. <laughs> yeah. We both have some guy plowing it, but we had, he hasn't showed up yet, so need it comes out up later. Just let me get it through the lock door. Yeah. Good, okay. You get your keys and everything. Okay, and then I'll go home and call a cab, and then we'll get a cab. Uh, I have to meet her down there. Got it. Yeah, we'll back in. Thank you. All right. Thank you, guys. Yep. Yeah. You guys have a good night. Yeah, you do. We're going to come back and look out of here. Okay. Watch out there. Yeah, we're good. Calling a fucking cab. Okay. You guys Sounds like there's stuff in there. Uh oh. Located right through here, okay? Oh jeez. That's you know, what it is. I have heck, I can't get nothing to come up. Yeah. So we'll take a peek at that too, okay? I'm gonna listen to you listen to your tummy here and when we get done. Get probably, hung, out. probably getting hung, probably hungry. Probably hungry. She had there was a cup of coffee and a uh, pop. And that's what I She didn't want anything to eat, so. I mean, you don't feel good. You don't want nothing to eat. Well, I, I still try to eat some soup or something. Yeah, but we I don't think we had any soup. We got soup in there. Not over the ground. Do your neck, okay? Feel kind of warm to me. That's for sure. Gotta check your ears. Open mouth. Your mouth say ah. Uh, uh, so there's dentures? Yeah. Dentures? Top and bottom? Yeah. Okay. I've had them a long time. Mm-hmm. Gotta find all your good toys now, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right there. I thought it was something else. 
I thought it was. I thought this was. I thought these were right, right oh, here. Oh, okay. Is that right? Uh, that's right. No, 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 that's what makes me pee. It sure does. That's what it's supposed to do. <laughs> yeah, but I don't like it to do that much. Yeah, well, I think you have something else going on that's making you go pee, okay? But I'm worried about your lungs, too, and then when we get this IV in here, I'll take a listen to your lungs on the back side. Um, did they do a chest x-ray when they saw you last time? Uh, doc, no, doctors. Uh, what, uh, <coughs> her, doc, her doctor is, in, is on South Land. Uh, can't even think of her name. I don't know. Doctor, uh, it's, it's a lady doctor, uh, but she didn't take no extra. She just listened to you. She, she, she goes, she got a real bad case of bronchitis yeah. and gave us some antibiotics. So she went back home and laid down and I got her antibiotics and I've been kind of monitoring her all day today. I have sure. too. We both have. Okay. Well, I've been staying over there for a couple of days. I know. I, was, I, just, she I didn't like the snow this morning. <laughs> yeah, the snow smells good. What do, you, what, do you, what do you think? What do you think? What do you think? What do you think going on with her, Doc? Couple things, I think. Well, one, we gotta make sure you don't have an infection in your urine, and then two, we gotta make sure we don't have an infection in your lung. Your the temperature's high. Temperatures are usually for a couple reasons. It's usually because of infection, and you know other reasons can be some medicines that you get sometimes to do it. But I'm gonna guess you have an infection in your lung or your urine. But we gotta test for both, okay? All right, piece it forward for me at all, just a little bit. Sit, mom. Sit. There you go. Good. Nice deep breath in for me. And out. Yeah. And again. And out. Yeah, go ahead and relax for me. You, you got some fluid in there too. So you have some stuff right here, which is more of like your bronchitis. Yeah. And you got some stuff in your lungs, it's more like fluid. A little pneumonia? Maybe. You might have a oh, subtle no. pneumonia. It's hard to say. Okay? Because she, she hasn't been, we, we haven't been. Like going in the out, cold. Going out this, this, this weather is one day yeah. it's warm, one day it's cold. One day. Now, next week, so this week coming up, we'll be in warmer again. Yeah, when you, sometimes when we get infections in our lungs, it's just because, you know, what happens a lot of times you get a viral infection like you probably had, and then you've probably got, um, sometimes you get an infection in your lungs after you've had a virus from a bacteria, okay? That because you had some injury, the bacteria that take oh. advantage of that, okay? How were you today? I haven't seen you for quite a while. Really? Doesn't seem like it's been that okay. long. So, uh, Me? I don't think I'm ready to come to Methodist. Can I push right there? I work used to work here, so. Did you? Yeah. Okay. My wife well, works here. We're going to so. get some blood work done, okay? We we'll need to take a picture of your chest here. Okay. I'm going to run him down to get something to eat. Oh, okay. And I haven't we'll ate nothing all day. And we'll be back. Hey, and Trista said that when we get done or whatever, uh, we'll come back and get the yeah, car because the road, main roads are nice. Hey Grandma, how you feel? We'll come back in a little bit and talk to you. I'll talk to her for a minute. Hey Grandma. Grandma, how you feel? You feel a little bit better, a little bit worse. Thank you, Doc. <laughs> I think if I come in here, you know, I always, I mean, I'm always with her. <laughs> Usually. Ain't we? Oh, five o'clock today. Well, <coughs> <more. coughs> you pissed. Gotta get her a high V started now, huh? Okay, we're gonna go down to the cafeteria, okay, I'm Grandma? I'm down to the cafeteria, I'll be right back, Mom. Okay, Grandma. I love you. Love you too. We'll love be right you. back. I'm going to leave my jacket here. This jacket is too warm. I'll leave it on. Where's my coat? Right there. Everything's in the bag. Everything's in the bag. My underwear and everything. I'm going to leave my coat here. I'll leave mine on. Well, that thing's warm. <laughs> hey, yours was warm. I'll be back. I'll, we'll be back in a few minutes there, young okay. man. Be, I know you'll be fine. We'll be back. We'll come back and get him Come back and see how you're doing, Mom. Love you. I'll talk to you later. Close it. Yeah, close it up. Okay. You're the, you're the x ray man, huh? I just did her x ray. That was it. Ah. <coughs> that was gummy. There you go. Get out of the way. Kick it out of the way. Get out of the way. <laughs> How are you guys doing today? I'm uh, fine. Staying out of trouble? Sometimes. Sometimes. 99.9% of the time. Can I have your finger, dear? Me? You are 99%. Mine's 60 out of 40. Yeah, yeah right. You too. You guys take care. Yeah, you too, sir. <coughs> 
Hi, but Grandma. You have, have to take your extra or your Kleenex. And they got my necklace over here somewhere. Where is it? I see it. Where? I got a little jar over there. Okay. You need to take it off. How you doing? What do what, they find anything? No, tell them. Well, it's on your computer right now. We went down there. So it's like Anthony's. And you had deep soup. Soup. Two, but a pop, two soups and two pops. Well, I had my soapy like I always have. Ten dollars. Two bowls of soup and a and a and two and he had a Mountain Dew. He has Mountain Dew and I had a soapy. I just wanted something to you know. And, and I'm only. It still feels like five o'clock in the morning. Hey, Grandma. Main what? roads are nice. Hmm. Main roads are good. Hey, Grandma, what happened? We could have we could have brought you up in the car. Hey, Grandma, what happened? I know how the roads work. Grandma, what happened at 5 o'clock in the morning today? I want to see if she remembers. They were long, John. She thought I was at Billy Jim. Who? That nurse? That nurse. She thought I was in the custodial. No. No. So how are you feeling, Grandma? Day, are you with yeah, Is it morning? Well, what's going on with her now? We can take this off your finger. That thing driving me going beep, 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 beep. Yeah, you're fine. So, have you ever had people do any tests on your lungs before? Has anybody ever told you you have COPD? Mm -hmm. Or chronic obstructive pulmonary disease? Mm -hmm. No. COPD. So, you know, going through some of your old imaging, uh, when you had a CT scan back in the fall, they showed you had some, maybe had some emphysema. Okay. So your chest x-ray today, it showed you have bronchitis. Okay, you have bronchitis. I'm worried that you have undiagnosed COPD. Okay, so the way we diagnose that is by outpatient testing. Okay, I'm going to treat you as having a COPD exacerbation or treat you for acute bronchitis okay so a couple things that go into that is one antibiotics so you'll stop your amoxicillin all right not working for you to start you on a medicine called leviquin you don't have any allergies right allergy uh, she's she's got more more I mean she's under uh, demerol and morphine yeah we're not gonna give you any of those leviquin okay and i'm gonna use steroids okay because you're wheezing we use steroids help with the inflammation, okay? So the steroids help with the tightness of your chest and it'll help get all this kind of thing. You'll feel a little bit like you're breathing a little bit better. The Leviquin will treat this and then um, the those two cut things in combination will help with this. I don't think you have a urinary tract infection. I think you're having increased urinary frequency and incontinence, how many children did you have? How many what? Children. Surgeon. Children. Children. How many kids, Mom? How many kids you got? How many babies? Two, yeah. yeah. Me two. and my sister. Okay, you had two babies, right? Yeah. Did you have vaginal deliveries? Or did you have C-sections? No, oh, I had normal. 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 When women have babies, their anatomy there gets distorted. And as we get older, the muscles get weaker and we don't hold our urine in as well. So it's something called stress urinary incontinence. It's something that can be treated as an outpatient, okay? So two things. So I don't think you have an infection in your urine. I think you have an infection in your, in your chest, in your, in your bronchi, okay? You, you have a bronchitis. And we're gonna give you medicines to treat that, all right? Okay. It's really important that you follow up with your doctor this week. You okay. need to give them a call and say, I was in the ER, I got diagnosed with acute bronchitis, and the doctor there thinks I have COPD. And I think you do. Okay? What's that though? COPD is a chronic lung condition. It's probably from your years of smoking as a younger woman. And as people age, they all develop COPD. So by definition, by your age, you do have some component of COPD. Okay, I gotta ask a question. Mm -hmm. uh, we I mean, I mean we go to different places, and people that smoke, do we have to do we have to stay away from the people that smokes? 
I would. Yeah, this I can't do. be good for your lungs. No, so that means that means mom, we, we can't be around a lot of people that smokes. Yeah. Well, they, as long as they they're not in the same room with you for days well, on end. No, but just just people that we we go out to see our friends and the yeah. people blow smoke right in her face and yeah. stuff. And I don't and I don't like it. That's why we get up from a restaurant or whatever. Yeah. That's why I always leave it. Yeah. I'm, I'm the one taking care. Of. I want to make sure she's taking. We but we all my my all of us yeah. take. Care. Yeah. So we have some things to work on. Nothing emergent is an emergency, okay? I think everything will get better with time and medicines, okay? I'm also going to give you an inhaler. You ever had an inhaler before? Yes, Mom, you've had them before. You yeah. get an inhaler today, too. You'll take that as needed for kind of wheezing and cough and stuff, okay? Up to four Don't times a day. Okay. Oh, okay. Up to four times a day. Alrighty. Uh, you already know her doctor, Sharehead, uh, Sharehead, Sharehead. Yeah. Yep. Sharehead. Uh, it's down there in South Korea. We, we, we don't live, we don't live only maybe, I don't know, not even. We, we well, share the same record good, system. Good, I'm glad. So whatever I put in the system, she sh did. she'll be able to read. Okay. Okay, when you go see, see her again. You need to get some lung testing done, I think, to make sure you don't have COPD. You might. Okay. It's not a, it's not a big deal. Lots of people have it. Very manageable. Yeah, we know, we know quite a few people has. Yeah. yeah so, and they they, just, they still live, live a normal life. Yeah, exactly. So. And I'll tell you what, at 85, you're doing pretty darn good. You only have one medical problem. That's a heart rhythm. Your yeah. AFib. Everything else is oh, pretty good. Oh, she's 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 give me a man, huh? <laughs> uh, I, I'm going to have to leave the here for about, for a little while. I, I'm going to have to go home and get my car. I came in. I came in with. I got a cab because I'm gonna hurry. My wife, okay. my wife, and my wife now. We're, We're not in any now. rush. We're not in any okay, rush. Okay, I will be back. I mean, I'm gonna leave him. Home. I'm gonna leave him here with with okay. her. And we'll get I'll, your. We'll get everything put together. So you're gonna get three medications, and I'll, you know, the the inhaler, and the two medicines you're gonna take for five days. And that's it. Well, okay. we, uh, we go. We go to. We go to Wal. We go to Walgreens on Fleur Drive. So. Walgreens on Fleur. I know where yeah. that is. Okay. I'll uh, send I your medicine uh, there. What, they close at what six tonight, don't they? Uh, yeah, I think I don't know. Okay, well, I'll get that. I'll, hopefully, we'll get you there before it starts. Okay. Before it closes. Okay. Well, there's another. There's another one that down on on uh, Park Avenue. It stays open 24 7, 24 hours a day too. So okay. I can, I can go to either one. Yeah. I can go to either one, and, and they know they got our records. Walgreens got our records anyway. Yeah, so. Yeah. Okay. So you're gonna three new medications: inhaler, antibiotic for the infection, steroids for the inflammation in your chest. Okay. 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 So I'm gonna finish up some of the paperwork here. Give me a little bit, and we'll get you on your way. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna call me a cab to get home right quick. I'm gonna tell if my wife if my wife's not even home yet. So I'm gonna, tell, I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna tell, I'm gonna tell her that uh, if you ain't home, uh, meet me at home, and we'll bring the car home. Okay. And, and we'll bring the board, and we've got everything right here. So okay. okay sounds, sounds good. good. Should be well, back about an hour. About, maybe about an hour. I'll be back. Okay. That sounds good. By the okay. time we get everything done, we'll be ready to do you'll, that. You'll be you'll be here with Grandma. Okay. Okay. You'll be here with Grandma. Take care, or take care of Grandma. Okay. I've been taking care of Grandma. Thank you very much. No, you're welcome. My pleasure. My pleasure. I'm glad we got some answers. I didn't I didn't know what was going on because she was guessing for air and everything. I'm like, what the heck's going yeah. on? Yeah. I've never... Yeah. Okay. Yeah. No, she ain't no nursing home. She lives, she stays with us, so... You yep. don't need to be. You're healthy. Yeah, she, she's a good, she, she's a good lady. Okay. You're healthy. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go call, I'm going to go cook you. Just That's my for a candy bar. And then I'll be home. Then I'll come uh, home. Have some money for a candy bar. I'll, I'll walk out. Wanna walk out to the candy bar? Yeah. Okay. Can I? I'll he's, be right he's back. Hungry. He's hungry.
should be here in a couple minutes. I told you I see a doggy. I told you. Okay. Got yourself. You guys need help? Yeah, no. I'm going home. No, we're good. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Hey, old man. <laughs> Grab grandma. Grandma, I've got. Okay. Come on, Grandma. They want to bring up, bring out. No, they asked, but I said no, we're good. Pull up a little bit, Trey. We'll get the car. Put Sammy in the car.